What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show y'all how to tame your pet turtles like if you come up if you can come up and do this to your turtle they just sit in your hand they're tame and also if you can hand feed them they're tame also like That's also another way you know they're tame. Like, how I got my turtles to be like this, I pick them up once a day, and I try to work with their hand feeding. That's the only way I try to feed them. Uh, he missed it, but he'll get it. I even got the, I even got the brim to hand feed. I mean, I ain't never tried it, but I know when I feed, they pick it off, so. There's my hand. Even the brim is hand trained. Those brim, I love those things. Those brim. Finish. I'll feed. I'll feed them after I film this video. But you get your turtles to be tame. Just like work with them every day. Just come. Just come by the tank every day. Pick them up. Then also try to hand feed them as much as you can. Try to get them to the top as much as you can. That's, it took me about, I mean, I got these turtles last week. So, I mean, you can tell I worked with them a lot. But to already be, like, just work with them to be hand fed. Like, don't just throw your food in there. Oh, I can't do that anyways because I got vicious brim in there. But don't do that anyways because... Then every time you walk by, it'll spook them. Like when they were basking up here, I, they didn't even, They at, at first they jumped, jumped away when I came, but now they're starting to get to where they just sit up there and I can come up to them and like even pet them when they're up there basking. They won't even jump down or move. So that's a, that's a good plus. And also uh, just come by every now and then pick them up put them in I already said that I think it was even last video I said this little guy right here was easy to spook and he wasn't hand feed but now I can come up here just let him chill in my hand drop them in by the way that one a far drop if y'all wonder it was like his legs were touching the water that's how close he was so if y'all wonder if I just threw him in there I didn't throw him in there Man, you can see all of them just coming up here, telling me, hey, every time I wake up, they're always like, it's like when they know when I wake up, they're already like, even the brim, they're already, they're already just sitting in the front glass. You can tell the brim, we're doing it now. Sitting here staring at me, all three of them. Yeah, but this is what they do every morning. They'll just come up here, scratch at the glass. That's how you know they're hungry. I'll give them about three pellets a piece. Just throw some stuff in there for the brim. The brim usually get like two pellets a piece. So yeah, that's that's my morning routine with these guys. I know I really didn't say a lot on how to tame your pet turtles, but that's the easiest way I found to do it is just walk by the tank, pick them up. Then when you go to feed them, like back in, I used to own pet turtles actually, and I just would put it up there. Maybe they would eat it. But now I know, like, know they eat because I'll, like, take a pellet, put it right here, then try to get them to drag my, I'll try to get them to follow my finger all the way to the top. And I worked with them, I'd, I'd pick them up and put it right in front of their face. None of, but that really spooks them out the most, you just throw them food in there. So the way to get them friendly and active and, like, scratch at the glass like they're doing now, as you can tell, the way I found them to do that is hand feed them. Get, like, work with them. Don't get frustrated because when I first owned turtles, I got frustrated because they wouldn't hand feed and paw at the glass like this. But, yeah, that's, I know it's kind of <laughs> sure of me saying how I tamed it. You probably expect like a 10 minute video of how I tamed my turtles, but. No, not really. That's just the easiest way I found to do it. Like I said again, pick them up and hand feed. 
pretty much. Pick them up recently too, like twice a day maybe, and hand feed them. That's the ways I got them tamed. That's how they are. These turtles I just did get last week, and they're already scratching at the glass. I know I do this every video, but I'm just going to do a quick feeding for y'all and wrap this video up. Feed the brim. I'll just throw the balls in there. I think I already fed them one pellet apiece, so I'll just feed them two more times for y'all. He got one. Where's the rest? Okay, this is what I had to do. This is what I had to do right here when I couldn't, when they won't hand trained yet. This one's wild when he gets some food. We got a backpedal and biting everywhere. Look at him. He's dragging the other one back with him. That's how wild he is when he gets something deep. See, that's the only problem. If they miss it, those brim are getting it. Look at, look at him dragging the other one back. Man, he's, this one's crazy right here. Okay. For the cutout, that one just takes way too long to eat. We'll go to backpedaling and just acting the fool. So this one actually, actually only eats shrimp. Let's see if I can pull him up to the glass. Let's see if he can swim to me. Usually he don't eat a lot. I feed the other one's three, but usually feeding him three is kind of a struggle. He only likes to eat two, so I, I give him two. I ain't trying to force some food. I'll get back to y'all when he's up at the top waiting to eat again. You tell he is. This one follows me everywhere. I've caught his attention. I think he might be coming now. There's his little cave right there. He likes that. This turtle likes to bask a lot. Get out of the way. I might have caught his attention. Wave the food out in front. Other ones eat, so. I'll feed the rest. Dude, that one eats just, that one's so smooth to eat. Like, he just takes it. Ain't no struggle. This one, look at it. <laughs> I'll show you all the whole process. Maybe it won't take long. He misses it and back pedals. Look at him, miss it again. There he goes, finally. Okay, did that one get jealous yet? Nope. Oh, he didn't get too jealous. Oh, y'all have seen him eat before, so. Ain't like the first time feeding or anything. Break these up. You wanna see my train brim? <laughs> Eat it right out my hands. But yeah, I think that's gonna wrap it up for this video. I know I didn't talk about how to tame them as much as the title says, but I mean, it's really simple. All it is is two steps. Just hold them as many times as you can. I know I've changed it for like hold them once a day to hold them twice a day, but realistically, just hold them any time, as many times as you can a day. And uh, and then try to get them hand feed the hand feed eat quickly. Don't wait until they're big to start hand feeding them because then they'll be spooked out by you. They really won't come swim up at the glass. The only reason they swim up at the glass like this is because they want something to eat. They know that you can feed them, and they know that they're about to get head fed. So yeah, that's my two steps. Hold them as many times as you can and hand feed them. So basically, that'll wrap it up for this video. I know it was short, but I, I'm coming back. I'm trying to post twice a day, so I'm coming back with another one. Expect at least Saturday. Uh, it's Friday now, so Sunday maybe, maybe Monday. Might hold it off to Monday, but yeah, man. I've, get, I've gained five subscribers yesterday. Keep it going. It really makes me happy to see a new subscriber. So like always, like and subscribe.